Well, we have a little six cylinder radial engine. It's actually two three cylinders and it's 80 horsepower, 3000 RPM, uh, electric start. Now, this goes back a ways though. This is just not something that you're introducing here at the show. It goes back almost 20 years when I first started. Uh, over 30 years. Over 30. Bill Sadler designed it originally, Bill Gewald developed it, spent 25, 30 years developing it to where it is now. I got it two years ago and uh, we're producing it in Shanghai, China now. So this is the engine here and it's a, uh, how many cylinders? Six cylinders. Six cylinder radial engine. Now, uh, what kind of horsepower are we putting out on? 80 horsepower at 3,300 3, RPM. And what kind of all weight are we looking at for that? 125 pounds. Now, if somebody wanted to mount this, what type of mounting uh, or arrangement have you made for it? We have a three-point mount on the back of the engine case, and we can make mounts, or they can make mounts for almost any firewall mount. And now, what about the ignition system on it? Uh, the 65 horsepower prop start has two distributors. The fuel injected model has two ECUs, electronic fuel injection, electronic ignition. It's a dry, gravity drain dry sump into a four quart uh, tank mounted underneath the engine. Um, now, how many of these are actually flying now? Well, prior to me purchasing it, there were probably 30 or 40 that actually flew. Uh, we have just a couple that we're testing. Uh, we're just getting started with production now. Now, how many hours say, have you got on a test stand or a running hand? We have uh, approximately a thousand hours uh, on two or three different engines that we've tested with now, with prop and on dynos. Now, have you looked at uh, into the future as far as warranty and TVO and that type of thing? Well, TVO is kind of difficult. It'd be, at, I'd say, at least a thousand hours, but we're not projecting any farther than that. It, it uses Volkswagen cylinders, Volkswagen pistons. Okay, the, so it's, it's a lot of the stuff is off the shelf. Then. Yes, it's basically a six-cylinder round Volkswagen. charging the battery and that type of uh, On the fuel injected model, we have a permanent magnet alternator and starter that mounts in place of the two distributors since we don't need distributors with the EFI. And, and uh, what kind of output are we looking at uh, for that? Uh, be it a 20 to 25 amp alternator output, 12 volt DC. Now are you selling a complete engine package to a customer then? We sell it with the uh, exhaust system and with the oil tank and we can provide a mount if you give us a drawing for whatever mount you need. And we're at uh, Oshkosh uh, 2012. What type of delivery times am I looking at uh, say if I wanted an engine here at the show? On the standard 65 horsepower engine we're looking at 30 days shipping time. And where are you physically located? We're physically located in Shanghai, China. I'm an American engineer. I live there. I work there. I design the products. Well, this is a totally different concept that you have here. It's a totally new product. <coughs> we, <coughs> excuse me. We just started this design. We use Suzuki cylinder heads, which are in production, and we design the crankcase, the crankshaft, the uh, reduction unit, and the accessory pad. This is the first time we've shown it, and we'll manufacture this in two cylinders, four cylinders, six cylinders. So 40 horsepower per cylinder, this four cylinder is 160 horsepower, 195 pounds. Now, is this a two stroke, a four stroke, or this radio? Four stroke overhead cam, four valves per cylinder. Uh, it's, the cylinder heads have been in production for 20 years. And it's, I presume it's liquid cooled? Liquid cooled. Yeah. And again, are you uh, dry sump or wet sump? Bottle? Dry sump. And the injection system on it? The injection is a Delphi injection system. Each cylinder has its own ECU. So a four cylinder, you got four complete separate engines. You can flip a switch and turn one on or off. And electrical system on this one? This is a 12 volt DC, electric start, a 35 amp alternator, automotive type alternator. Uh, the parts are readily available. Suzuki, you can buy at any motorcycle shop. Uh, we've designed it so it's easy for the owner to maintain it. 
this is a fairly heavy reduction drive you got on. I presume this is just for the uh, higher output uh, engines? Yes, this one is designed for the six cylinder. The two cylinder and four cylinder can have a lighter weight, narrower belt, but they are the, the Gates GT2 carbon fiber belts. They're very sturdy. Inside the big sprocket, we have rubber dampeners for the vib torsional vibration. Now, how long has this engine been under development now? Four months. So it's relatively new it, on it's, market? It's brand new. We just barely got it to the show. <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking at having it actually out in production or yep. when you start to... This time, this time next year. So if somebody wants to get a little more information on your radio or on uh, this engine, uh, what's the easiest way to do that? The best way is my email, don at sciaviation.com. Our website is www.sciaviation.com. Thank you very much for your okay. time. You're welcome.